man, what's happening in Sniper Gang, man? I refuse for this to happen. How dare y'all, man? We get it to Thanksgiving. And we have family fallouts, man. Where's the collard grains? Where's the beans? Where's the mashed potatoes? That's the only thing that can get these two back together, man. It's the only two that can get these linkers back together, man. I refuse for this to happen. I refuse, and I refuse to let Sniper Gang break up. We already had Ben Simmons ruin, and I mean ruin, Philadelphia's chances to get to the playoffs, the finals, and I, 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 I refuse to let this happen. Say you with me now. Kodak and Jack Boy cannot have beef. Say it with me now. Hey, what's up? What's happening in this kid? We back in this thing. Okay, show me we sleep in the cut. But when I want to turn. So over the little skit, we here to talk about some shit real quick. You know what I'm saying? Got a little haircut. The head ain't used to it yet. Anyways. Here to talk about Kodak Black and Jake. When they appear to be a little beef in the family. And like I was saying, nobody wins when the family feuds. You heard me? And we here to talk about that shit real quick. I don't know why they have fallen out. I seen it yesterday and I was fucking confused because I'm like, what fucking problem I have? And it's just so crazy because, yo, Jack Boy has improved so much. Bro, I have listened to a couple Jack Boy projects in my time recently. And they are so, bro, he has improved. That is very good. I had a good time. It was a great listen. I had a great time. Some type of fucking yeah. Bro, I enjoyed myself. I had a great time. A couple of toe tapping bangers I heard. So long. It's very, yeah, very nice, yeah. And now it seems they're falling out. And they, I have been seen dissing each other online. Now Jack Boy came out and said, yo, that's my brother. I ain't doing nothing. And then later on today, I seen like Kodak. Kodak was like throwing money in the ocean for some fucking. I'm just confused by this thing, man. I think I have to be a Florida person to decipher the hieroglyphics. I need to be Haitian, you know what I'm saying? I need to speak the Creole to understand what the fuck is going on here. But anyways, let's get this shit busted. Jack Boy held it down for Snapper Gang while Kodak was locked up, but it seems they finally now a favor with one another, another seemingly sneak this and each other online this week. Fans are under the impression that Kodak and Jack Boy have fallen out after they both made cryptic posts referring to some shady business that went down. Speaking on his signed artist, Kodak wrote that he made a M off low Jack and, and that it took long enough, but that business must must be stood on he also tweeted that he is not signing any more rappers to his labels saying these n-words are ungrateful okay jack boy apparently used the kevin gates song vouch to respond to the sniper gang boss which fits this situation a little too well put the folks in my business gotta set court appointments gotta suit up with lawyers damn this how we rock him posted jack boy using kevin gates lyrics to speak on his own situation. They copyrighted my name and wanted $1 million. The label laughed in my face. I had to pay out my pocket. It's unclear what exactly went down between Jack Boy and Kodak Black to cause this rift. Some fans believe that this may just be a fake feud to stir up controversy, while others think this could be real deal. So there, yeah, some posts here. Yeah. So yeah, Kodak was saying his shit, yeah, and Jack Boy. So, we don't know if this is 100% true now. Kodak Black and Jack Boy don't look like niggas to me that's going to have fake beef for publicity. They ain't the game that will just be for the nigga and then drop an album. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is at, at, the, at the end of the day. But besides that, bro, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I Like, hmm. It is very like very what, what I I just don't know I mm, it's just a weird time in life like it's just like why are like it honestly makes no sense honestly with more information Jack Boy side like yo he's still cool that's my brother whatever we see Kodak throwing money in the ocean this shit just confusing and it make no sense bro I just think I need to slur and tie like Kodak but hey if we gonna get Project Baby three and this shit gonna sound fire. We get no flock in part three, and this shit is fire, my nigga. Listen, I am at no this shit, but in all honesty, I hope there's no beef between these two niggas. Like in the article said, Jack Boy been holding it down when Kodak was locked up, dropping some of the best music I've heard from him to date. So we really need to hold this riff together. I really like them together. They do good songs together. They're very good. Like 
I enjoyed them together. So I hope they don't break up. If it does get to the point that business kind of ruined this friendship, hopefully they can be okay and go their separate ways. Yeah, and like if it's some business shit, I'd rather them handle this shit in private rather than take it to the internet and do all this other shit. But yeah, I say my piece on the situation. What do y'all think? Do y'all think this is some real beef or they building publicity, which I 100% doubt that is the scenario that's going on. But yeah, man, you know what it is? I'll talk my shit real quick and I'm off of this thing. Hey, you know what it is. Like, subscribe, help your boy, help your boy girl. It's been K.A. I'm off of this thing. Shlam Zoom Peace, y'all. Elge Gang. Aye.